Hey guys, all right, so you have unboxed your keeper and you have determined that you need to do a midline attach because you have a spliced eye that won't push through. So, all right, thing to note, you're gonna have to take all three of the sheaves out. So I've already done two of them. There are two different sizes of screws that go in the keeper sheaves. The long ones go in the handle and this shorter one goes in this lower swing arm right here. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish out this third one. Pop that out of there. And now that all of those are out of there, I'm ready to install my line. Okay, so I have to figure out which side of my saddle I want my keeper to go on. Me, I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on the left-hand side of my saddle right here. So to orient my line correctly, so that once I place it all, it's right, I'm gonna take my hardware, I'm gonna put it out in front of me and follow my line back towards the tail. I'm gonna install the line in this top slot right here. Put a sheave in with a long screw. And before I actually lock this down, I'm gonna finish it all the way out. So now I'm doing the lower sheave, and that's going to take the shorter screw. Notice that I like to do it from the back on this one, um, just cause it makes it easier later on. Um, and then I finish it out on this side right here. Okay, so now that I have it like this, I'm just gonna double check, make sure that it's how I want it and that everything's flowing in the correct direction. Once I've determined that, I'm gonna take the screws, which are all the same, put it in there with one drop of Loctite on it, specifically a type of Loctite that doesn't make that a permanent fixture, because if you ever wanna change your line out, you want those to be able to back out. So, after I screw these down, and you can't over tighten these, um, this is designed so that it just comes to a stop where it's supposed to. Swing that out and actually grab it like this. That makes it easier. All right, so now that I got that all hooked up, there's a little set screw right here. I'm gonna take that out. And right here, I'm going to put this in the location that I want it. And tree motion, it's a little harder because of this Leather is pretty thick. Take your set screw, put it back in. There you go, just like that. Hook up all your hardware. Now you have an install keeper. All right, we're gonna do another video specifically on how to use the keeper.